Catherine, thank you. I, I'm blown away by what you said. It's extraordinary. And Catherine, you know, we were great friends. Ben was great friends with Kay. And when Ben and I first got together, um, it was kind of a big scandal. And nobody would invite us anywhere. And we were sort of these outcasts. And until I remember December 7th, Pearl Harbor Day, Kay had a dinner party. And she invited us, Ben and me, to come together. And I remember walking in the door, and one of my friends came up and said, okay, you're now accepted. Kay has given you her blessing. <laughs> and Kay was, um, she was the, we, we had this wonderful dinner. Uh, and she, later, when we were picketing the, the gridiron dinner um, that Kay didn't go to that night, a bunch of us were out with picket signs marching up and down, all of our sheepish male friends in their white tie and tails kind of slinking in. <laughs> and Kay didn't dare picket, but she and Meg Greenfield, who were the, um, and Meg was the editor of the editorial page, couldn't stand it. So Meg got in her car and drove, kept driving around the block with Kay hiding on the floor <laughs> sort of peeking over the edge to see what was going on. And when I got married, Ben and I got married very quickly, I had sort of given him an ultimatum. And, uh, <laughs> he didn't really have much choice. And so we, we put this very quickly together, and I called Kay and asked her if she would be my matron of honor. And, um, and she, we got married in a judge's office, and she was in New York on a business trip, and she um, got on the plane, and on the way to the plane, she stopped in, in, in a cab, ran into a floor shop and bought me a bouquet. Where she, I mean, we really put it together very quickly. And she carried it on the shuttle all the way down, sitting there with a the bouquet with flowers, I mean, with, with ribbons hanging down. Um, I loved Kay very much. And um, one would have thought no one could have replaced her. But in fact, that's not true, because Catherine has all the qualities that Kay had. And um, uh, she's just been an extraordinary publisher of the Washington Post. Kay adored her. She was Kay's favorite, although I'm not supposed to say that. <laughs> and um, Kay basically always said, you know, Catherine's the one. She's, she's the one. She's got it. And i got to tell you, she, she does. And aside from being a brilliant publisher, she's a total babe. <laughs> <laughs> and that's really what counts. <laughs>